IPOB press release of 17th of July 2024, IPOB press release of today. Avert the gathering storm and release Mazen Namde Kano as his health deteriorates. IPOV. The global family and movement of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOB, led by the resolute leader Mazen Namde Okuchuku Kano, once again call for the unconditional release of our leader, leader from DSS solitary confinement over his deter deteriorating health condition the nigeria government is intentionally provoking ipob by refusing to release our leader even when the nigerian and international courts have ordered for his unconditional release ipob wishes to reiterate that the life of our leader mazinam de kano is in danger in the solitary confinement of the dss in abuja we have persistently called on the nigerian government to release our leader as both international and local law institutions have ordered for his release. Many prominent Nigerians, religious, traditional, and the political leaders, including 50 members of the National Assembly, have equally called for his release, but the Tinibu's government has refused to listen to the voice of reason by refusing to release Mazen Amdekano just like his notorious predecessor saw a government of Buhari, Dinibu's government has discontinued similar cases of terrorism and treason charges against two Yoruba activists and a Fulani militia leader. Militia leader. In the case of an Igbo man, unarmed freedom activist Mazin Namdekano, this same Tinibu's government have vehemently refused to release him. Mazin Namdekano have subsisting local and international judgments that ordered for his release. Unlike the other cases discontinued by the federal government without any court judgment, we are enumerating all, all these injustices to demonstrate that the federal government of Nigeria is intentionally provoking the anger of IPOB and Ndebo. IPOB has maintained a non-violent approach in the Biafra struggle irrespective of the high-handedness of the Nigerian government against Biafra act activists. Mazen Namdekano is seriously sick and must be released unconditionally from the SS solitary confinement for him to treat himself before something unpredictable and unimaginable happens to him. Mazen Namdekano's help is going down every day under the SS solitary confinement because of the nature of his health issues. IPOB is calling on President Bola Ahmed Tinibu and his Attorney General Fatai Fabwemi again to release Mazen Namdekano so that he can go and treat himself before it's too late. Mazen Namdekano and IPOB members have been persecuted for over a decade by the Nigeria state, by the Nigerian state because of Biafra's self-determination. Mazen Amdekano was kidnapped and extraordinarily renditioned to Nigeria and has been detained in solitary confinement for over three years. Although no court in Nigeria has found him guilty, yet he is being persecuted by the tribal bigot government of Nigeria. President Ahmed Bola Tinubu, please note that Mazen Amdekano is sick and something terrible can happen to him if he is not released. Nothing must happen to him in the DSS solitary confinement in Abuja. As John F. Kennedy said, those who make peaceful change impossible will make violent change inevitable. Comrade Emma Powerful, Media and Publicity Secretary for the Indigenous People of Biafra.